Hi everybody, I'm Zoe, and I'd like to show you an easy way to play Opa Gunnam style. The song is made up of two basic patterns. First pattern, simple way. B, 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 D. So we go one, two, three, four, five, six. That's the first pattern. Second pattern, one, two, three, four, five, six. Quickly, one more time. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. If you're feeling a little brave, you can possibly add two notes. F sharp and B. Try it this way. Again. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. The left hand, you simply play a B because the song is basically in B minor. And what we are playing are the notes of B minor. F sharp, B, and D. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, one. This being the fourth time, we go to E minor, which is G, B, D. Three times, one, two, three, and F sharp minor, A, C sharp, F, A, C sharp, F, one, two, three. Again, the fourth time, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six. That is the basic riff of the song. After playing the first part four times, it then goes to this little bridge section, which is in G major. So it's two notes at one time, B and D. Two, three. F sharp, C sharp, and A. Goes down to E, and then a B major chord. You could play the whole chord together. Again, B and D. The second time it goes to F sharp major. A sharp, C sharp, F. And this is where he plays with the rhythm. First he plays it slowly. One, two, three, four. Double time in quavers. One, two, three, four. And then basically in semi-quavers. One, two, three, four. Six, seven, eight. There's a pause. And then. And the song starts all over again. I hope you have a lot of fun with this. Use your imagination and see what else you come up with. Thanks again.